we all know that uh, too much of carbohydrate is uh, not very good for people with diabetes but you should also know that there are what are called as good carbs and there are bad carbs let's see the bad carbs first bad carbs come with direct sugar and sweets that you take polished white rice refined wheat all those will have a high glycemic index white bread for example these are all called as the bad carbs the good carbs comes in lentils beans legumes brown uh, rice or unpolished rice whole wheat bread brown bread these are all these are called as complex carbohydrates and these are called as the good carbs so within carbohydrate itself don't think that all carbohydrates are bad select those which are called as the good carbs or the complex carbohydrates and try to eliminate or avoid those which are called as the bad carbs now why are we so concerned about this good carbs and bad carbs because if you take the complex carbohydrates the good carbs they don't increase your sugars all that much there may be a small rise in your sugar level whereas when you take the refined carbohydrates like i said the white rice white bread uh, glucose sugar uh, jaggery honey all these very very sweet things when you take you will find that your sugars shoot up the postprandial sugars or the sugars after your food tend to go up when you have very high blood glucose levels and if your glycemic index of the food and the glycemic load is very very high they can lead to diabetes blood pressure heart disease and even some types of cancers very recently we published a paper as part of the pure study where we showed that a very high glycemic index can also result in increased mortality this was published in the new england journal of medicine so it's very important to know which of the foods can increase your blood sugars that is they have a high glycemic index which of them have a low glycemic index and try to have foods which have a lower glycemic index this will mean that every time your blood sugars will not peak very much and thereby you can prevent not only the complications of diabetes but also heart disease and many other complications Thank you.